Hi guys! In this video, I'm going to discuss on how to evaluate rational algebraic expressions. In evaluating rational algebraic expressions, what we're going to do is you will just substitute the values of the given variables to the given expression. For example, here in number 1, 4xz cubed over 7y, what is its value when x is equal to 8? y is equal to 4 and z is equal to negative 2. So what we're going to do here is we'll just substitute these values of variables in the given expression. So we're going to have here 4xz cubed over 7y. This will be equal to 4 times x is 8 so times 8. Then z cubed, so z is negative 2, so we're going to have negative 2 cube. Then this is over 7 times the value of y here is 4 so times 4. Then this will be equal to 4 times 8 then negative 2 cube is negative 8 over 7 times 4. Then in here 4 in the numerator and 4 in the denominator so we can simply cancel this one this is 1 so our answer here will be 8 times negative 8 this is negative 64 over the denominator 7 number 2 negative 5 a cubed b squared c over 2x squared y when a equals negative 1 b equals negative 4, c equals negative 2, x equals 5, and y equals negative 2. So we're going to copy first the given expression, negative 5, a cubed, b squared, c, over 2x squared, y. This will be equal to negative 5. Then a here is negative 1, so we're going to have times negative 1 cubed. Then b squared, b is negative 4, so we're going to have negative 4 squared. Then c times negative 2 over, this is 2. Then x is 5, so we're going to have here 5 squared. And y is negative 2, so we're going to have here times negative 2. Then this will be equal to negative 5 times negative 1 cubed is negative 1 negative 4 squared is 16 so times 16 then times negative 2 all over 5 squared here is 25 so we're going to have 2 times 25 then times negative 2 then we have here negative 2 in the numerator and in the denominator so cancel out this will be 1. Then 25 and negative 5 here. These are divisible by 5. So negative 5 divided by 5 is negative 1. So this will be negative 1. And this will be 5 here. And 16 and 2. These are divisible by 2. So 2 divided by 2 is 1. 16 divided by 2 is 8. Then multiply negative 1 times negative 1 is 1 times 8 is 8 times 1 is also 8. So we're going to have here 8 over 1 times 5 times 1 here. This will be 5. So the answer here will be 8 over 5. And number 3, 2x squared plus x minus 6 over 2x squared plus 7x plus 6 when x equals 2. So we're going to have here 2x squared plus x minus 6 over 2x squared plus 7x plus 6. Then we're going to substitute x with 2. So this is 2 times 2 squared plus 2 then minus 6 over 
2 times 2 squared plus 7 times 2 and plus 6. Then this will be equal to 2 squared is 4 here times 2 that will be 8. Then 2 minus 6 here is negative 4. Over 2 times 2, uh, 2 squared here is 4 times 2 is 8. Then 7 times 2 is 14 plus 6 that will be 20. Then 8 minus 4 is 4. 8 plus 20 is 28. Then simplify this one divisible by 4. So this is just equal to 4 divided by 4 is 1. 28 divided by 4 is 7. I hope this video helped you. If you have questions about the topic, Please comment down below and see you next time.